In today's video, I'll be showing you how to install Paint 3D on Windows 10 and Windows 11. So Paint 3D allows us to edit photos and images with ease and you can do many different things within the program or app should I say and I find it very handy to have installed on my computer I must say. I just recently done a video on how to remove the background from a picture in Paint 3D so if you're interested in knowing how to do that then click on the link in the description below which I will add a link to the video. Also, if you are interested in seeing more Paint 3D videos, then click that subscribe button as I will be doing many more videos. So the first thing that we need to do to install Paint 3D is open up the Microsoft Store. And you can do this by opening up the Start menu and then typing in Microsoft Store if you cannot see the icon here under Paint. Once you search for the Microsoft Store, you then need to open it. You now need to click in the search box at the top and we then need to type in Paint 3D. You will then see the option for Paint 3D. We now need to open this option and you will then see a Git button. Don't worry, you do not need to be signed into the Microsoft Store to be able to download and install it to your computer. So we can now go ahead and click on Git. Once it's finished installing, you would then be able to click on Open or you can open up the Start menu and you can then search for Paint 3D and you can then click on the Paint 3D app. If there is an update available, then Paint 3D will begin to download and install that update. And once it's finished, you will end up with a window that looks like this. So you can now go ahead and click on new and you can then begin to get creative and create whatever you want within Paint 3D. And also, like I said, edit many different photos and images and stuff within it. So I hope this video did help you out and you enjoyed it. If you did like the video, click the like button below. And if you'd like to see more computer sluggish videos, then click that subscribe button. If you do subscribe, then I will see you in the next video.